Can you give us a sense of how many people are using it? How many transactions and sales are happening here and how it's grown over the last couple of years? Yeah, sure. So uh, in terms of transactions and sales, it's all private. So we don't really have great numbers on that other than anecdotally from talking to some of our more contributing vendors and things like that. Um, but I can tell you that, you know, generally we have around 12 to 14,000 listings at any given time uh, available on the marketplace. Um, since we released our t second version, we've had about 160,000 people on the network and we get about, we see between 400 and 700 new nodes on the network every day. The way that we're able to see that data is that through our search engine and crawling the network, um, you know, we know which IPs and, and peers were, um, connecting to in order to like crawl their listings and, and, and reviews. So that's based on raw data that our nodes sees when it crawls the network every day. Um, and so, you know, and in terms of usage, um, I mean, I would say we're still at a very like consistent, you know, you know, kind of horizontal growth, just slightly above horizontal, <laughs> you know, it's not like hockey stick growth or anything. Um, and we tend to ebb and flow in correlation with the popularity of crypto across the mainstream. So, you know, when we get, you know, price spikes and everybody gets excited, we tend to get more traffic. And when it's down, we tend to be down. So I think that we haven't really been able to escape, get that escape velocity outside of just general crypto insight. And to us, that means that our users are mostly people within crypto space and people that are knowledgeable in that. Like we don't see a lot of people outside of that, that network using the platform, um, which is something we'd like to change with the mobile app. And I think, I think we have a good chance at, at improving that. But for now it's, yeah, we're looking at like, we call them crypto curious, you know, it's like people that are just, they want to know more about crypto and how to use it in a, in a day-to-day -day fashion. Cause there really aren't a lot of ways to like, once you get Bitcoin, I mean, you can buy something from a website or whatever, but like beyond that, what else, you know, are people using it for, um, other than kind of speculating and trading? And this is one of those good options.